Hey, how's it going? Back again with another Pokemon Go episode. This time we're going to feature the new level 1 raid bosses, which are around thanks to the Adventure Week, which is lasting more than a week. It's going to last until the 5th of June. So we've got five, six more days to uh, avail of these raid bosses. And new level 2s, level 3s, some returning level 4s. Um, so all quite fun to do. And one of them with a shiny chance, which is a level 3 Aerodactyl. So we're going to focus on level 1s today, as I said. So we've got Anorit, we've got Lilith, we've got Kabuto, and Omnimite for the very first time. Uh, I suppose it makes sense. Uh, Omnistar and Kabutops were level 3 raid bosses for a while, so I was assuming those would return. But because Kabuto and Omnimite have their shiny versions available in the game, it makes sense that you don't skip a shiny and get a shiny Omnistar or Kabutops. So we're going to see how well we did. We went in with good counters. See if we could get a really good time for the Raid Times website. So check them out. See if you can beat them if you can. Sign up to the Raid Times website and post your score based on the move type and if it was boosted or if your Pokemon was boosted. And uh, let's see how we got on. And then we're going to do a level 3 Raid, which is an Aerodactyl. And then we're going to show you some shinies we managed to catch during this event so far. So, let's check them out. It will never get lost in Seeking the truth in Also last night the Pokemon company announced some new games coming to the Switch. Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee coming to the Switch in November and it'll have some integration with Pokemon Go. So any Pokemon you catch in Pokemon Go you can transfer across to the Switch. I'm wondering if it can work the opposite way because I think there's rumours of a new Eevee evolution. So maybe you'll be able to obtain that in the Switch game. 
and transferred across um, to Pokemon Go, which will be a bit pay to win, but we shall wait and see. To celebrate this, Pokemon Go have released uh, Lohan Executor, which is now in the game, and you're gonna see that being caught now. Uh, can have a shiny version as well, so probably a good chance this morning of actually getting the shiny because there's so many around. So we shall wait and see on that. Um, definitely an interesting Pokemon with its Dragon type. Um, it's currently sunny as well, so it's boosted. So we shall wait and see when Antique will release the others, if they'll come in a batch or if they'll come one by one. Um, so we can um, catch them every so often or maybe they'll have an event after Adventure Week. We'll have to wait and see. So, I'll talk to you all tomorrow when we go through the level 2 raid bosses. Sorry to interrupt, but during that recording, I was on my way to Oliver Plunkett to do a level 3 Aerodactyl raid. We've probably done 7 or 8 so far since Adventure Week started. We got some pretty good times on the website as well, so check those out. So we're going to fly through the battle and then we're going to go to the catch screen because it's probably worth checking out.